Hey, so what is up, YouTube? It's CB Cool, and well, it's 2022, and we are almost at the release of Brilliant Stars. And guess what? We just hit 500 subscribers on the YouTube channel recently. So, guys, this is going to be a custom Pokemon booster box opening, and I don't know when you are going to be seeing this, but I'm going to probably wait for my community tab to be up so I can announce it, get a lot of information out about this, and kind of just wait a little while before you see this. It could be March when you see this. I'm filming on February 1st right now. I don't know when this video is actually going to go up, but... I will be going to CollectorCon at the end of the month in Orlando, Florida, so that's going to be awesome. Maybe get some vintage packs, like, oh my god, that would be crazy. But it's been such a long time since I've filmed a full-sized video. The last one was actually the card shop one, which I wouldn't even really count. But um, I've gotten my two ver first graded cards. This was just a pickup from the card shop. This isn't actually, like, for my collection. I just grabbed it because I thought it was cool. It's GMA, it's not worth anything. But this CGC 9 Mint Charizard is absolutely insane. I love it. I got this for like 15 bucks or 16 bucks. It's totally going to go up in price, people. I'm not stupid. Um, <clears throat> but I did want to tell you guys, new year, lots of new plans for the channel. I have so much Brilliant Stars pre-ordered. I have the V-Star collections coming tomorrow. And by the end of the month, I will have a booster box an ETB, a Build and Battle Stadium, Build and Battle Box, all the blister packs, sleeve packs, I think like 72 total packs worth, um, so basically two booster boxes, so it's going to be absolutely insane, nice drink, and um, oh yeah, I opened, as you can see in the front of this box is a Hidden Fates pack, but I opened one pack up on a short and I got both of these. It's actually out of a Gyarados tin that I have off to the side that I got at my card shop, of course. So, um, or my LGS, brand new LGS opened up in my area, and I'm so happy about it. It's so cool. I love the place. It's called Venice Sports Cards and Collectibles, so if you want to go check it out, go ahead and do so. But i got to get my sleeves ready for this opening, because this is about to be absolutely insane. So, guys, let's get right into part one of our... Pokemon Custom Booster Box, which is going to be the left side. Let's get into it. So, wow, oh, wow, guys, do we have an absolute ton of booster packs here. As you can see, Shining Fates and Cosmic Eclipse right on the top of both sides of this half of the box. So there's an absolute, like, crap ton of packs here. So um, I'm going to roll my sleeves up on my hoodie, and we are going to crack into these boosters. Started off super strong with the Shining Fates. Now, I'm not going to show you guys what's in it. We're just going to randomly get into this. And all these packs are from random things. I'm not going to show you guys what's in the other side. Got to get some anticipation, people. We can't be giving you, I can't be giving you away everything that's going to be in this right away. But I'm going to give away every single code from this box, so go ahead and claim all of the code cards. These are going to be a little bit of longer videos, so hopefully you guys are stay, stay tuned for this. Fire-type energy. It's a water-type energy, people. This is randomly out of a tin, so can we get a pull? I do not know. Eevee, that's nice. Um, I truly don't know. Nah, it was the dud pack. We got the Indeedy Hollow. But you know you got to appreciate every single card. Um, you can't be hating on any Pokemon cards, especially when you're doing an opening this big. You can't be lucky on everything. So, honestly, I am so ready for this. <clears throat> cards are going to be set down on the bottom. You guys don't really need to see them, but get a closer look at that in DD. Very nice looking artwork. I actually think it's pretty cool. But, you know, you guys are probably looking for the huge giant pulse. We have battle stops. Okay, uh, Battle Styles, not a good set. Why you put this in the box? I like Battle Styles. You guys can hate on me for that, but I love Battle Styles. And introduced a new type of Pokemon card with the Single Strike and, stri single strike and Rapid Strike. And there's just so much involved with these that I just think the packs are really nice. And I'm just not going to hate on them. So I can't be bringing you guys as much content lately. Leaf type energy because of the um, school year coming back up. And I know over break, I was uploading like every single day. I should have spread the content out a little bit more, 
but I was just so excited to get in all the stuff I got on Christmas that I just wasn't thinking. But, um, you know, you, it happens. You get too excited, just like with this. Tapu and Age of Slash. Um, <clears throat> but just, I can't, you cannot go wrong with these. These boxes are always so fun to just do a custom box. Actually, I believe this is the first time I'm doing like a full custom box. I could have done it before. We have Sun and Moon base set here. I could have totally done it before, but you know, I just didn't think enough of it to actually start doing it. And um, water type energy, there we go. We're just gonna get into these like they are the most simple normal boosters ever. I'm not gonna speed through any packs. So if you guys wanna skip through the video, go ahead. But I love just getting through the cards slowly and seeing every pull that we can get. Timer Ball and Two Cannon. Because you have to appreciate every single card that you have in your collection. You can't be unappreciative of anything. That's the thing. So we're not doing really pretty good here. We're not doing pretty good in the case of pulls right now. But a lot to talk about. Um, lightning type energy. Oh, we got the gas, the energy. Pets on back. Leonhardt, there's a lot of talk about too. Like with Leonhardt just at his pop-up shop, a lot of people didn't have a great experience like the Pokemon Squad because it was like a really, um, it's just, it was sped up. It wasn't, it was just not well done and there was huge lines. It took forever for people. Ooh, Cinderace Reverse Rare. That's really nice. I like that card. And a Malamar. Um, and other things like Logan Paul losing $3.5 million on a fake Pokemon first edition booster box case of base set and that was just like crazy we're getting our first pack of vivid so man these are bad pull rates um him just losing all of that money on gi joe of all things um psychic it's fighting um but yeah there's just so much that's just absolutely crazy going on in the card community. I can't explain enough to you guys. But the next thing for you guys after this video is most likely going to be either the V-Star boxes or we're going to be getting the um, tour of um, basically what I'm going to get at the Orlando um, Collector Con. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be cool. I collect on. This is our first pack of celebrations. Now, these are throw ins. So, there's actually 40 packs in this box because I threw in some packs of celebrations. But I'm not counting them since they are only four card packs. I am not counting them since they are only four card packs. So, these were just little add ins for the fun of it. Just for the fun of it. But you guys can take the codes on all of these. I don't know what we can get here. You never know. We have Zekrom. Cosmog, Zacian V, Xerneas, not a mate. I mean, like, that is technically our first ultra rare, but like, I don't, I wouldn't, eh, I wouldn't count it. It's, um, it's just very common to get if you open celebrations. So that is technically our first ultra rare pull of the video. Rebel Clash, this is our first one of this set. Guys, I don't love Rebel Clash, but I don't hate it. A lot of people hate it. Oh, there's no Charizard. Okay, you can't be hating on everything. But let's go with a fighting type energy. It's a dark type energy. Um, just a lot going on in the community. I think um, I just, I'm a mess right now, guys. I have so much to worry about with school and work and the channel, my cooking channel. I'm just running so much right now, even my TikTok. But I just have so much that I'm doing that I don't feel like I'm bringing you guys the content that I should be. And I'm sorry about that, but hopefully in the future, I can give you guys some amazing content. Like over summer, I'll be able to film you guys a lot. Okay, white and green on the battle styles. Let's go. Let's get a pull here, people. Let's get that Altar Tyranitar. All right, we got the Spite Dark Type Energy, Bufalant, Crawdunt, Grumpig, Chimeco, Horsey, Hone Edge, Mankey, Glen Slowpoke, Cubone into a single striker Shifu V. Why not? I'll take it. Um, you guys, <clears throat> thank you for getting me to 500. I really appreciate the support. Sun and Moon Crimson Invasion. 
But the next goal, I'm not doing a, I'm not doing a big opening for 600 or even 700 or any of that. The next thing is going to be 750 is the next time that I'll be doing that. Let's get that rainbow Gyarados here. The leaf type energy dash and pouch, Laron, Kakuna. And then, of course, I'll be giving you guys a 1,000 subscriber special once we get to that mark point. But, um, dash and pouch, Kartana GX. I have not pulled a GX card in a hot minute, so this is so just, it's just fun to pull. I haven't opened sets like this in a long time. I mean, uh, I opened Cosmic, but, like, it's not amazing. Like, Cosmic is literally next. We have another Sun and Moon base set here. Let's get another GX. Let's get that full art Umbreon. Let's go. Solid green code, but there you go. There, and we have the pack. Let's go. And there we go. Water type energy, guys. Basimian, Rotom Dex, Pukamuku, Morlul, Skarmory, Poliwag, Sandigast, Eevee. Very nice. Nest Ball. And Cosmoa. Let's clean this up a little bit. Now we do, we're gonna have one more celebrations pack in this Cosmic Eclipse. Let's go. Amazing set. This side isn't really as stacked as I would say the other side of this box is. The other side of this box is absolutely insane. Like there's so many good sets in the other side of the box. But um, let's get into this pack. We could get the character art still. There was a green code. I'm gonna say that. But we could still get a character art. You never know. I just want it to be one that I never pulled. Eevee, Carvana, and a Golurk. I didn't even see that that was the reverse for a second. Um, is there anything else even amazing in here? Yeah, we do have the celebrations. We have some, eh, some more sun and moon. So if you guys do want to stick around just to see if we can maybe get one insane pull in this side of the box. Go ahead. But these pull rates are trash, garbage trash. So, wow. Um, I'm knocking the camera way too much. I'm sorry, guys. Um, Grumpig, Bruxish, Bufalant, Tapig, Pachirisu, Mindfu, Ball Toy, Mr. Mime, Tapig Reverse, and the Stun Journal. Now, guys, I'm not perfect. I'm not the perfect YouTuber, okay? I'm not Pokey Rev. I don't have that perfect quality 4K content videos and all the insane vintage openings, but I'm me. And that's all that matters. These cards feel really thick. Let's go through this. Little Eradicate, Wishy Wash, Dartrix, Pikapet, Eevee again, Psyduck, Spearow, Dratini, Snubble, and Two Cannon. This isn't lucky. We only have three pulls so far, guys. Only three. So does that mean the second side of this box is going to be absolutely goaded? Or is this one going to pick up? Oh, white and green. Let's go. I did. Part of this was a chili green three-pack blister. So you know, you got to get some pulls in there. Pull this around here. We got the leaf-type energy, weeding gloves, Porygon 2, Kakuna Matata, Shup it, Cubfu, Blitzel, Quillfish, Larian Slowpoke, Hatchrum, hey, a Celebi V. Okay, of course I pull the Celebi V Max right after I buy it for my master set. Um, <laughs> I don't mind a second one though. That's absolutely beautiful. That's a nice looking card. I will take it. First V Max pull of this box opening. We have Vivid Voltage next. Can't be hating on no Vivid Voltage, it's awesome. Even with the solid green codes, you can still get the pulls. Let's go, we got the Metal Type Energy, Excadrill, we have the Nuzleaf, Opal, Skadoo, Skadoo, Da Doo, Ferrisseed, Joltik, uh, Wismer, and the Lucario, and regular rare, nice regular rare. You deserve the recap, Lucario. Any other in here that we feel deserve a recap worthy? No. Lucario does deserve that recap worthy spot. Celebrations pack number two. Now, this was out of a collection box, a Pikachu V Union. So, there's got to be some sort of special collection pull in this one. 
Go ahead and take that code for yourselves. Gotta get something. Okay, I'm not gonna flip that around. Kyogre, Dialga, Cosmog, and the flying Pikachu VMAX. That is going to be our second VMAX pull. Which isn't an amazing one. I keep pulling flying Pikachu over and over again. Rubble Clash. All right. A lot of these are out of mini tins, tins, just a lot of random stuff. That's why you're seeing so much random Sword and Shield era sets, is because I pulled so much out of, like, tins. But we have the Fire-type energy, but there's no fire pulls in this one. Deblade, Lumbre, Hatrim, Vulpix, Coughing, Shinx, Yamask, Applin, Trubbish, and the Caesar Skazor. He deserves the recap as well. What an amazing Pokemon Caesar is. Now we have the Fusion Strike Pack next. We're going to be ending this on the Sword and Shield base set right after that Darkness Ablaze. So hopefully we can get some good pulls out of here. Uh, darn it. I know I do have an Evolving Skies on the other side of the box. I will tell you guys that. But none in this side of the box, sadly. We have the Power Tablet, Beware, Dracloak, Marill, Helioptile, Wooloo. Love that artwork, by the way. Gossifleur, Mudkip, Panguru, and a Kangaskhan also deserve in the recap over there for us. Not a bad pack for a regular rare. I will take it. Darkness Ablaze up next. We could have done better. I admit, we could have done better on this 18 booster packs. Like, come on, no full art, no rainbow. What is this? God, so, okay, so it's all up to the Sword and Shield base set. All up to the Sword and Shield. These are so glossy. Because it's the reprint. Error pack. Error pack. We've got an error pack. We have a hollow Golisopod and a solid green code card pack. Look at that. Solid green code. Hollow rare Golisopod and a Kabu. Final pack is the Sword and Shield base set booster. What shall we pull in this? I do not know. I don't even remember what this is out of. Oh, yeah, it's out of a treasure chest tin. Okay, this has to be good. White and green. Let's end it on, like, a golden dog. How cool would that be? Let's go through this one slowly. Psychic. Heatmore. Drizzile. Ordinary Rod. Diglett. Ferrisseed, Goldeen, Roselia, Joltik, Glaring Meowth, and a Sableye V. I'll take it. Don't think I ever pulled this from Sword and Shield Base. So I will take a Sableye V. Let's get into our recap. All right, guys, recap time. Now, this was kind of a sad box, but, you know, we got that other fire half. We got the Caesar, the Lucario, the Kangaskhan, Galisapod, and DD, and the Ultra Rares. We're coming at a Zacian V, Single Striker Shifu V, Sableye V, Kartana GX, Flying Pikachu V Max, and the best pull of the box would be the Celebi V Max. That is a very nice pull. Only six pulls that were worth. Me a while, I would say, out of this box. Um, and that says 18 pet actually, no, 20 packs if you include the celebrations. Some not good pull rates, but it's okay, guys. You can't always win it. Um, that's gonna do it for today's video. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the bell notification icon or button to get notified every single time a new video goes up. Please make sure to check out all of the links in the video description down below and subscribe to all of those amazing channels and stay tuned for part two coming tomorrow or whenever. I don't know. I'm a mess right now, but stay tuned for part two of this box and I will see you guys in the next Pokemon video. Bye. See ya.